They're green and gold. And a top seller at Scani Nation. Today, it's just through the roof. The downtown Madison clothing store has sold more than 4,000 of these humorous t-shirts with a deliberate typo. You know, growing up with Brett Favre, was my, he was my quarterback, um, the whole story has just kind of ruined the legacy for most people in Green Bay and just, you know, it's become kind of a joke. You know, he's a good player, but I think it's a shame for his legacy that he's been bouncing around so much. After hearing the news, State Street shoppers headed for the Brett Favre rack buying novelty t-shirts for friends and family. Many people were talking about Favre's first game against the Packers. I have a feeling it'll be really mixed because some people, you know, just want to see him play, but, you know, the diehard Packer fans are, Vikings aren't really our, our friends. And fan relations likely won't improve with t-shirts like this. And while it's hard to imagine Favre wearing a purple uniform with Viking horns, some fans say they won't wear a t-shirt labeling Brett as a traitor. I've had a few people stop in and say, you shouldn't be selling that. You don't realize what he's done for, you know, the state. And I just, I just tell people, listen, I'm from Green Bay. I still like Brett Favre. It's, you still have to admit it's a funny t-shirt.